good morning, Yinsin. Good morning, Nabila. Great. How are you feeling today? Not too bad, but I wish I could sleep in. Great. So are you ready for a speed date? Kind of, but there's no guy here. Okay, so let's start. What is your favourite weather? A weather that I can sleep in. I think it's a rainy day. Desserts or snacks? Snacks. Favourite season? Spring. Countryside or city? Countryside. From zero, to, from zero to ten, how busy are you for in the past week? Eleven. Your plans for the weekend? No plans. What do you do to spend time with your family members? Eat good food. How do you practice healthy boundaries with work? There's no boundaries. What do you do for fun? Talk to people that I like. Uh, go to fun places, but we haven't been out for a year. Something unique about yourself? I appear to be very free to a lot of people, um, but nobody see that I'm juggling all the time. A significant achievement in your career? I don't know what I've done to, you know. I wish I could have done more. Such as? Well, perhaps during the early days, I should have done my ICAEW, and then maybe three years after I work, I could have done my law degree, but I didn't do any one of this. I Instead, I focused on working. Biggest challenge in your career? Well, being a female, uh, I used, uh, I mean, People judge me a lot during my early days because in my profession or in my line of work, I have to work with a lot of elderly men or men who are um, who think that they are smarter. So they judge before you can even prove yourself or perform. But um, I guess things have gotten better for me over the years because either people have got to know me or they have known my track record. So things have gotten a little bit easier. Your definition of success? Well, I don't think that should be a target uh, to define as a success for anybody to do anything but I think it is always about breaking our own glass ceiling that we set. It is about um, doing the best that we can and achieve whatever the you know the most that we can. I think that defines success and again success can be defined in many ways. It can be happiness, it can be um, a consequences that uh, a consequence to a decision that we make that will lead to a later success, but not an immediate success. So, success is a, is a very wide and broad um, term to use if you want to define success. And I think when you were younger, the way you define success could be very different from the way you define success um, 10 years or 5 years later. Empowerment or encouragement? Both. How do you juggle between life and work? Oh, I juggle all the time and there's no line between work and life. How do you see yourself in 10 years' time? Well, I hope that I can still look as young. <laughs> Wisdom or intelligence? Both. If you're too wise but you're not intelligent, you know, you won't be able to make the right decisions or you don't know enough to make decisions. But if you think that you are too smart but you are not wise, then you may not be making the best and the best decision for that time. Freedom or stability? Uh, I think we need both. Your greatest pet peeve? I hate people to gossip but I like to join the gossip as well. <laughs> one value that you hold dearly? I think integrity is very important. If you could tell your younger self one thing, what would that be? I should work three times harder. How do you maintain your energy level as a busy woman? I think I eat really well. I try to sleep well, but I don't get to sleep so much. So, um, I just force myself and get going. And keep going. Apart from being selected Obama Young Southeast Asia Leadership Initiative Mentor, you were also being awarded as Young Global Leader by the World Economic Forum. What is one important leadership quality that you think young leaders should have? Be bold, be brave. Uh, think of the impact of your actions. I think that's the most important thing. What is one philosophy of life that you practice daily? If you want to do something, just keep going and do it and don't ever look back. And even if you make mistakes, just learn from your mistakes and don't hold the regret or grudges because that will only pull you down but not do any good to you. Amazing. Before we wrap up, do you have any message you would like to share with other women out there? Be true to yourself, be brave, uh, have integrity, be honest, um, and I think the most important thing is love yourself. Great, that's inspiring. Happy International Women's Day. Thank you, thank you so much. Please do enjoy your tea. Thank you for having me.